Hello, hello, and welcome once again. J76NY here. We are on day number 19 of our Abdicom campaign, February 20th, 1942. It is currently 1116 at night, so air operations are unavailable. Uh, just a note, I am now running with the uh, newest version of the Abdicom mod, 1.5.1, I believe. Uh, big thanks to uh, your T for his help. Uh, getting my save so it was compatible with the new version. Um, unfortunately, I couldn't convince him to front me several thousand command points to play with, but I am very grateful for the help with the uh, save file. So uh, we do have some new assets that are available, and we'll see those in the future. Um, certain ships are now available on the 2nd of March, which is uh, coming up in about a week or week and a half uh, so I'm looking forward to that as well as our new batch of command points uh, which I've been thinking is probably going to go for a submarine force um, going forward my strategy is right now to retake Benja Mason we're not too far off um, troops are starving with no ammo but we are working on that we've got task force 2 Heading up, uh, may have to alter their course a little bit just to avoid uh, this. Uh, Marblehead is with them, but I'd rather not get into a surface engagement with anyone at all. And my uh, cargo ship, so we're going to move them out a little bit. Uh, we do have Task Force 10 with the sloops or cutters or destroyer escorts or whatever but they're beat up pretty bad so they're probably both going to be released uh, right now we don't have the course set for them so they're gonna just come down here for now it's gonna take them a while to get down there because of how damaged they are uh, fuel ship is heading back um, uh, let's see, task force here. Uh, we do have some troops we could pull off here, but I'm not going to. Uh, supplies we could pull. But this is our main base of uh, rearmament, so we're going to leave that alone. Uh, Till Jap. Oops. I guess we can't see how many planes we have. Uh, it's probably not much. Uh, Batavia... Uh, it's looking okay in terms of the uh, engineering and fuel. Uh, Task Force 2, which has seen a lot of action in the last couple episodes, is still patrolling in this area. Uh, they're getting pretty low on ammo. So, uh, let's see. Exeter is in a sorry state. Uh, Houston still has 738 rounds of, I believe, armor-piercing, uh, plus a lot for her secondaries, uh, but she's damaged. Um, she's only able to make about 15 knots, so once we are in a position to add a few more light cruisers to that group, um, probably going to pull Houston and have her go rest and repair. Uh, over here, we have Task Force 13 with a supply ship and the Warrego. They are heading up. I was thinking about sending them up here to pull some troops off uh, Singapore. But then I noticed we've got troops and supplies here on Palembang. Um, we could get them off and run them down to Batavia. Batavia is turning out to be our forward air base, so I want to kind of keep that uh, well supplied. Uh, S5 is on their way up to Singapore, which has 710 troops left alive. Um, this is my dilemma here, is I don't know if I want to stop in Palembang and then go back to Batavia. Or just say sorry to the 24 that are still there and take it up to uh, 
Singapore to get the 710 troops. But that is that going forward. Uh, very close to getting more command points. So we're going to get through the uh, night of day 19. And uh, see you on the flip side. Task Force 2 is under attack from uh, the air. Uh, we've got a whole lot of these coming at us. Plus we've got some torpedo armed planes, land based planes. Um, didn't even think about it when I sent them up through there. That That is now a Japanese air base so uh, we are eh, kind of in trouble. So we're going to break. Uh, you are going to lay smoke and turn away. Uh, where I go? Now pick your speed up, turn. Okay, it looks like they missed on their hit, their strike on the uh, Abakir here. Let's have you turn back the other way. Borrego, do the same. Don't want Borrego to make smoke here. Oh. Took a hit. Let's get the uh, fires under control there. Oh, there's a lot of planes coming at us. Borrego. Not good. Not good at all. Now we got... Oh, so many torpedoes about to hit us. Uh, let's have you... Have you turn away? I don't really want to have Warego run parallel to them. Just because I don't really want to try and dodge all these torpedoes. It looks like this group's moving in on Warego. And this group's moving in on the transport. Uh, fires are spreading. <clears throat> I have to slow her speed down a little bit. Ain't run straight for a little bit where I go. See if we can get any of them down. Turn out. Try and avoid these torpedoes. This group has dropped. Slow your speed. Yeah. All right, where I go did dodge the torpedoes, so we'll bring her back. Luckily, this uh, supply ship is empty. They're shooting a few of them down, but I don't think that's really going to matter in the long run. And she got hit by another torpedo. All right, well, 
I'd say this is a dead, uh, dead cargo ship right here. Luckily, Rago didn't take any damage. She's still shooting at someone. Oh, the fleeing aircraft. Uh, we shot down one, two, three. <laughs> three of them. You can stop making smoke. Have you hold your fire? Oh, we got more? I don't know. These were probably just the ones that were, uh, out there. But, I would say that's it for, uh, our efforts to Do some good up in Sumatra, or, uh, Singapore. Back with the Warego. And they aren't going to leave us alone, so we're going to have to fight our way through here. Uh, Warego is... Steaming pretty close to land. Uh, she's going to use up all her ammo trying to shoot these planes down. Um, not really a big fan of having to dodge attack planes the whole way through, but I may just pull those troops off the uh, island or the base there and send her back. If she manages to make it through up to Singapore, I'd be very, very surprised. So they are coming in on us over land. And it looks like they're just spinning in circles right now. Kind of interesting. Oh, they broke off, I guess. Oh, here they come. I guess they were just waiting for their full flight to come in. And that's more than a full flight. So, uh, quite possibly a uh, carrier in the area. I don't know why they'd be over land now, but um, where he goes in some trouble, to say the least. They are dive bombers, so. And there's a lot of dive bombers. A whole lot of dive bombers. I'm gonna try and maneuver her as best I can uh, to get her out. diving All right. those bombs missed those did not all right we got one of them down Trying to spin around, maneuver as best I can. That was not good. We still got a whole line of them coming at us. All 
right, now she's on fire. Or not. Ouch. I'd say Borrego's done. She's. Yep. And just for shits and giggles, here come some more bombs. But they missed, so. Hey. Well, that sucks. <coughs> Poor Borrego. Poor Warrego. Uh, okay. So, that didn't work out so good. Uh, we do have a flight of inbound uh, whatevers. They uh, probably came from either here or way up here. But I did launch uh, some fighters. Here they are over here. Uh, they're going to come in. Provide some cover. Uh, I don't really have any other fighters in the area. So, hopefully these guys can intercept them before they get down here and uh, take them out. Okay, three ships. Four ships. Uh, we're going to see what this is all about. Um, let's get our... Not sure what these guys are. Two 600 pound. I should probably see what they are before I go launching anything. So let's uh, take a look here. Anything? Well, they're out there somewhere. Alright, there's one of them. <sighs> Again, you. Okay. Well, there's uh, another cruiser, light cruiser, the other damaged Nagara's decided to show up. wonder how uh, fast she would be going here. Five knots. Okay. Well, we're going to have to deal with that. Of course, now we've got this here. We can't uh, get some planes up first here. Uh, we're going to go with these guys. Not entirely sure what they are, but uh, six 200 kilogram high explosive bombs. And you can get up. Uh, Tiljap. Yeah, you can't offer much in the way of support. Unfortunately. I'm gonna do this. And go into tactical, see if I can see what this other group is down here. Uh, one, two, three destroyers. Alright. So we've got a group with three destroyers, a group with a damaged light cruiser, and several destroyers. Uh, right when I pull Task Force 2 out, too. So... There's that, so we gotta get our planes in and deal with them when we actually can. Uh, this right here is kind of concerning, six ships. So we are going to see what they are here. Uh, Task Force 2 is in the area. Where are you? 
Where they are, right down there. Destroyer. 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 I could strafe with these guys. Um, but honestly, I don't want to lose them. So. We are just going to get them out. At least we know what's in the area. Uh, I do think Task Force 2 could handle them. But. If they don't have to, then why? I probably should do some strafing here, at least on one of them. But like I said, I got just got these planes. I don't want to lose them. So we are going to turn around and run away. This time we are not going to turn around and want to run away. We've got that group of three here. Um, let's see what we got here. Oh, big flying boats. All right. Big flying boats. Kind of a cool looking plane. All right, we've also got these two guys. And then, unfortunately, it's not the cruiser group, so. All right. Let's get these guys up. have them come out like this. Doesn't look like they're uh, burning, so I have you go after number one target here, all of you. Up. Like how they're all in their own individual groups. It could be beneficial, but oh, hold up, a target. So we'll get them up to altitude. Uh, we will launch our attack from 10,000 feet. Our first group is moving in. They are maneuvering, so the targeting may be way, way off on this. Not looking bad, though. All right, drop. Eat up. Go. Uh, these guys. Need to head back in. Okay, let's see how we did with our first bomb drop here. Uh, eh, close. 
I guess. Looks like these guys are going to come in probably at about the same time. One of them was a group of two, I thought. Oh, there he is, way the hell out there. Just come back. Wrong way. It's going to be kind of hard to do with two of them coming in at once. We'll drop it a little before it. I think this is going to work very good. Oh boy. Okay. Well, that's botched. Hey, go away. Already passed where this one needs to be. drop. Go away. This one's coming in here. Uh, let's have you kind of head up like this. You. I don't think any of these are going to hit, but... It does kind of look like they formed up in a line ahead and are steaming straight. Yeah. Got close with that one, but... That is about it. Okay, he's coming in. He's coming in. We're going to slow him down quite a bit. I'm going to try and drop before and in front, just slightly. Or there. Oh. That's close. <laughs> risky, risky. Away they go. Speed up. Get out. Alright, you slow down. See how we did with this one. Oh, so close, so close. Alright, we got one more left. Come in a little closer.
maybe try and have them run straight down the center of this formation here. Works too. All right. Not looking bad. Kind of hoping to encounter, get that uh, that cruiser group there, but. Make one little juke here. And drop. All right, you can get out. See how we did. Oh, there. Nice. Two hits. I will take two hits. Better than all of them missing. What the damages are. Heavy damage, heavy flooding. All right, we're going to keep her in the area to see what we can see, and then maybe these fires will spread. Maybe we'll have a magazine explosion. Uh, who can say? I'm not entirely sure where these heavy bombers are going. They are over Java. Uh, there's a lot of them. You know, we got our fighters in the area. Um... So, we're going to break these guys off and form them up into groups of two. Uh, let's see, one, two, three, yeah, that'll work. We're going to have you target and attack number one. And then you, by yourself, uh, come in on uh, first group two. Like I said, I have no idea where these uh, where these heavy bombers are headed, but got two of them. Actually, I think we lost one of our planes we did. Dog fighting over land or on the sea. go. Ah, that was just wrong. Got to target this guy.
Come on, get him. Oh, what are you doing? Come on, come on. There we go. We lost four, three of them so far. Wow, look at that. Never seen a plane in this game do a barrel roll before and then turn completely side. <laughs> look at this. <laughs> yeah. He's happy. Look at him go. Yeah, this bombing group uh, bypassed my entire surface group. Both of them. Shoot. They won't shoot. They by bypassed both my surface groups, and now they're flying over Java where there's nothing. I don't think the game models paratroopers dropping into... Uh... Oh, we lost another one. Shoot, damn it. So we're going to lose all these brand new fighters I just got. Shooting up heavy bombers. We're gonna lose more planes than they did. He's right in front of you, dude. Shoot. We're getting outmaneuvered by heavy bombers. Someone dropped some bombs. I'm not really sure what happened there, but whatever. Whoops. Someone shoot this guy down. Come on. There we go. All right. Well, there's that. Nine out of nine. We lost four out of seven, so... Ah, uh, was it worth it? Who can say? All right, taking a look at the uh, base at those planes came from. Um, yeah, unfortunately, we don't have the engineering or fuel to replace them just yet, so uh, might not be a bad idea to get some uh, engineering and fuel up there to um, rearm those bases here per air fuel plane fuel engineering uh, we don't have any so one little run um, up there should be enough to uh, get them what they need to replace those planes uh, over time they will be replaced uh, rest and repair I'm gonna take a quick look at what we have uh, 13 days for this e-class uh, our losses including uh, the merchant and the warrego uh, six. Uh, we've lost submarines, uh, three subs, two destroyers, and a merchant. Uh, enemy losses to cow, uh, merchants, light cruisers, submarines, destroyers, another light cruiser, uh, Nagara, another light cruiser, a Mogami. Various destroyers and a submarine, Miyoko, Mogami, uh, Tenryu, 
destroyers, 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 uh, destroyer escort, uh, Nagara light cruiser. So their total lost ships is 35. Uh, they've lost 43 aircraft. We have lost 114. So that is kind of the spreadsheet of how we stand right now. <coughs> ah, anyway, if you like the episode, hit the like button. If you have any thoughts, tips, or advice, leave that in the comment section below. Uh, if you want to follow along through our Abdicom adventure here and join us for episode number 23, hit the subscribe and you can come along with us, and we will see you then. J76NY saying thank you very much for watching, and have yourself a very good day.